This is Bill Brady speaking on the topics of repentance and faith. Specifically, this is going to be a series of short recordings leading to how to prophesy. But since we prophesy according to our faith, I'm going to address repentance and faith, faith first. There's a relationship between repentance and faith. The more you repent, the more faith you're going to have. It's just as simple as that. Um, lack of repentance hinders your faith. It's like as it's as if it was a uh, it is a container, and initially it's full with things that we need to repent of. <laughs> and as we repent, that leaves room for faith. The more we repent, the more room is left for faith. And once we have fully repented, then we have room for perfect faith. Perfect faith is mature or complete faith. So, the amount that you repent is equal to the amount of faith you're going to be able to function in. The amount of faith that you have and that you can function in. I'm going to try to keep these very brief. So I've gotten that general principle across to you. One more general principle that's just come to my attention recently, and I'm starting to uh, think about it and get revelation on it, is that you can repent up to a certain place and then function in the faith up to that level that you've repented. But past that point, in order to repent anymore, you have to fast. Uh, it's sim as simple as that. I don't think that anybody can get to a place of perfect faith without having fasted. So I'll just put that seed out there for you to think about, and I'll get more revelation on that, and I'll teach on that at a later point. Now, there's one more thing that I want to address before I go leave this particular recording, and that is, if we're in a higher age, we should be functioning in that higher age. Um, someone might say that to you. These are low, these are kingdom age principles, so you shouldn't be having to deal with these because you're now functioning in the age of Melchizedek. Well, the response to that is, if you never dealt with them to begin with, then you haven't finished um, all that you need to do with respect to the kingdom age. It doesn't just go away because now you're also functioning in the age of Melchizedek. There's this particular path that gets you from here to there, and you can begin to function up here before you finish this part of the path down here. But if you don't finish the part of the path down here that you didn't finish, you're not going to be able to do all that you need to do in the higher ages. Now, here's how I can show this to you from Scripture. The six elementary principles of kingship. The first one is repentance from dead works, followed by faith towards God. One and two. If you don't do one, you can't do two. To the extent that you do one, that's the extent that you can do two. If you completely repent, then you can func function in full faith. And you can come to the place of perfect, mature, complete faith. There's a direct relationship between repentance and faith. The more you repent, the more your faith you're able to have and function in. You can only function in faith to the extent that you have repented. It's as simple as that. Okay, that's enough for now. You may want to listen to this more than once.